Lovelies, it's Donna, and today I have an unclaimed mailbox from Fun Delivered. So it's been a little while since I've been able to get my hands on one of these. They sell out so fast. She only releases them on Fridays, usually around noon. I follow her on Instagram just so I know when they're going to be released. So last Friday, I set my alarm. <laughs> I was determined to get a box, um, and the regular boxes were sold out. So normally there's an unclaimed, it has random things in it, and it's like $79. This one, though, is a little different, which I'm a little excited about. It's the big and tall box. It has six unclaimed pieces of mail, but they're awkward sizes or big sizes. It's huge. That's why I'm doing this here. I don't normally film right here, but I figured it'd be easier to see. Um, there are six big and tall boxes in here. Now, they're unclaimed mail, so it could have been refused mail, incorrect addresses. Sometimes companies receive things back and they just wholesale them out. Um, so that's where she gets her inventory. She buys them in bulk and then she creates these really fun boxes. No clue what's in them. She doesn't open them. Um, she just packages them up. It's really fun to see. I'm going to leave her Instagram below um, in the description and also the link if you want to grab one of these um, if you like a good mystery. So that's what it's all about. I do have other ones. I'll kind of link them throughout the video um, and I'll link the playlist below in the description if you want to go back and see some of my other ones. So let's dive in. That's enough talking. And let's see what is in my big and tall mystery box. you. That's about the best I can do. And let's see what's in here. I'm definitely going to need my scissors, I think. Oh, this one's weird. Kind of feels like foam rollers or some sort of yoga ball. Sorry for my reflection here. It's from my front window. <laughs> oh, maybe mats or what is this? I have no clue what this is. Oh, I have no clue what this is. Some sort of a whole bunch of rolls of them. This is how they come. And there's one, two, three, four, eight of them. What is this? It has a design on it. Can somebody tell me in the comments what this is? It's like foamy and then the back is a peel off tape, but there is a design on it. So where does that go? Does that go around like a tub surround or something? Okay, that's an odd one. Have no clue what that is. <laughs> that's the thing, you don't know what you're gonna get. All right, we're gonna pull out this long one here and see what's in here. Let's see here. I think it's fun. She also does a small mystery box. I'm hoping to get my hands on that has a whole bunch of smalls in it. Um, and then, like I mentioned, the other ones, I've already done those before. Okay, once again. What in the world? Bubble wrapped. I'm kind of getting sword vibes for some reason. I see some tassels. Lots of bubble wrap. I don't know. What am I getting myself into here? Hang on. Oh my. I think it's maybe an umbrella, but it's very decorative, like a sword. It's got tassels, and we've got a design going on the handle. But this looks like an umbrella. <laughs> well, that's kind of fun. It is an umbrella. Let's open it and see if the umbrella itself has any design. Now, even like the handle has like this, it's plastic, but it looks like metal design on it. I know you're not supposed to open umbrellas inside, but we're going to what I do for you guys, right? Okay, so we're just looking at a plain black umbrella, but it has like a samurai sword. Oh, it has an automatic button on it. <laughs> I saw that before I got pushed on accident. That's funny. And then it just hopefully clicks back in there. Okay, well at least it's useful. Not quite sure who's gonna be using that, but what do you guys think? All right. Let's keep trucking here. <laughs> We've got another one. Feels like maybe a lot of clothing or fabric. So let's see. That would make my day. My channel is normally clothing and try-ons and things like that. So let's see. That is what I'm seeing. Sport fitness. Ooh, okay. We have got a pink, what looks like a shirt. 
We've got maybe some leggings and a variety of sizes here. Ooh, we've got some red. I'm seeing a try on in my future here. And they're all larges, which is great. Like a mauve color top. Oh my word, it's a jackpot. We've got a bra. We have tan pants, potentially. We've got brown pants. Some sort of red meshy top, possibly. We have maybe some pants again. Oh my gosh, this keeps going. Something black. We've got some more gray pants, maybe, and a white top. Oh my word. This is exciting. And then I think another bra. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13 pieces of athletic wear. I'm gonna do a try on haul video separate from this because this would just take too long for this video. So check that out. If I do it before the end of this video, I will link it at the end. Um, so you can check that out if you're curious on that. So lots of exercise clothes, that's cool. Okay, a few more popping in here. We've got their card hiding in there, fun delivered. Okay, so we have got a long box this time. I think that athletic wear alone, if some of it fits, will be worth the cost of this box. So that's pretty awesome. <laughs> no clue what this is. Looks like a boat toy, maybe shell of some sort. Looks like a model of something. HPI Racing um, Baja 5B. If you know what this is, let me know again in the comments. It's some sort of model car parts is what I'm getting. Like maybe this is the spoiler on the back. Is this a car? Is it a boat? I have no clue. I'm going to have to look that one up. But that's pretty cool. And I might be able to show you on the screen if I can find it, um, what that is and what it's about. So that's pretty cool. All right. This one's calling my name. T.S. Couture. Lang Lanting Bride. Are we getting the dress? Let's see. Again, that one I might try on for you guys. <laughs> Let's see here. Better get it taking these things, that's for sure. I'm seeing pink. Maybe it's a bridesmaid dress. Somebody didn't have their dress for a wedding. <laughs> oh my gosh. Definitely a full outfit. Okay. We've got a dress by TS Couture. Special occasions. This is a full-on beautiful gown. What size? I don't know yet. Oh my goodness. This is definitely a beautiful dress from somebody. It's got a bow in the front, lace detail at the top. Oh my goodness, and it has like a longer train in the back it looks like than the front. If I'm able to, let's see what size this is. It doesn't say. If I can squeeze into it, I will try it on for you guys, I promise. But it's not just a dress. <laughs> We also have a bunch of accessories in here. Possibly a choker with rhinestone gems. A bracelet, rose gold with some gems. Maybe a purse, let's see what this is. What I'm thinking is a purse. Okay. That's cute. Okay, you can wear that with anything. It's a cute little bag with a zipper on it. That's cute. And then when you close it, it does close up like that. So you can carry it as a little wristlet. Okay. And then we have, whoa, we have a headpiece here. Let's see here. We've 
got a full head piece. I don't know if it really matches this though. Hmm. Okay. And then lastly, don't know what this is, so we gotta open it up. Maybe another head piece? What is this? A veil, maybe? No, no. What is this? It's a head piece. <laughs> what is that? I mean, it's got the clip that it would sit on your head. But why would you put that on your head? <laughs> it does have some feathers and some other things. It says you have to kind of fluff it up a little bit. So, yeah, huh. Can be blown by hot air or stuffed into the hat with soft paper. I don't know. Okay, that was a shocker, all of this. So, hmm, don't know what I'm gonna do with that, but I at least know that it is worth some money. So let me set that to the side. We've got one more package, so hang tight. Here you go. I told you I'd try it on. A little too small for me, so I'm definitely gonna be selling this. Purse is really cute though. My daughter has homecoming soon, so this is gonna be perfect, but what do you think? Here's the full. <laughs> so it's short in the front, long in the back. Not sure what I would wear this to ever. <laughs> what do you think? Okay, <laughs> let's see here. One last, it's very lightweight, but I'm feeling some styrofoam. So let's see if I can get this out. All right. These companies get points for um, packaging, that's for sure. They're making my job kind of hard today. Oh, we've got some glass. not know what this is. We've got a fancy glass, all kinds of shapes, and then a ball. <laughs> Closes it up. Is it just a decorative vase that you could put things in? That's kind of cool. I mean, I guess you could put some sort of liquid in it, maybe, um, but I could see you also filling it up for the holidays with different things in it throughout the year. Some stones, colored stones, and a plant. If you wanted to do that, like one of those little cactus things you could do. Okay, I'm very impressed with this box, actually. I kind of like this better than my other ones. <laughs> so we have the really cool glass thing. We have the weird foamy things. I have no clue what those are. We have the samurai umbrella. All of that fitness clothes, a wedding dress, and some sort of model car or boat. I think this was definitely worth the $99 that I paid. It's free shipping as well. Again, I will leave everything down below if you're interested in snagging one for yourself or for a gift for Christmas. I think this is really fun and <laughs> cool gift to give away. But that's all I've got for you guys today. What did you think? Leave your comments below. All right, till next time, guys. See ya.